I would mention it. I want to talk just for a minute about body positioning. It's not such a huge deal on the 6010 root because you're only welding a quarter of it at a time, so you don't really have to reposition. But now that we're going to get it to 7018, we want to make all the way, make a pass all the way from bottom to top. All right, take it, take a dry run on it, and I'll see if I can. Okay. So if I'm, if I'm going to strike it. I'm going to strike it here. I'm going to come down to it. So you're kind of propping with the one hand, so that. You're not jagged when you, yep, like your I'm, knees I'm, when you're when yeah. you're squatting. It helps you. It helps you stand up smoothly. Yep. And I just kind of slide. I do the I do the boilermaker slide. The boilermaker slide. <laughs> Come Aiming for the center line of the pipe, I have found, kind of helps you keep your electrode angle right. In your mind's eye, shoot for the center line of that pipe. I got Andrew here to pretend that the end of the pipe is the joint. So he's going to feed rod in there as he repositions his body and makes the round from bottom to top. You can see he's having to do quite a lot of positioning there. you got to have that in your mind ahead of time or when the helmet drops, uh, everything changes. Here he's doing one left-handed, which he says he would, he would do if he was taking a welding test just because he's comfortable doing that. Not everybody is. So, it's me. You know, I, I, would, I, I try to do something like a little bit of an angle that way. Yep. And here, and I'm going to prop either directly on the pipe here. With it. I'm going to be, it's going to seem awkward to start with, but when I light up here, in fact, I'm going to go ahead and twist my, my wrist to where, where it's good here, but a little bit awkward here. Yep. You know, so and then when I light up here, I am coming around. And you're yeah, and then again, I'm having to shuffle my feet, do the dance thing here, but at least I got, you know, that's me. That's what I have done before. I, I'm perfectly open to the one-handed thing too. I just uh, I would probably actually use one hand, one hand, right hand, but just do the same, yep. same positioning. Try to light up. And again, I'm not very far under it here. Just you know, you're a little bit uncomfortable when you start, so that after you get going a little bit, you get comfortable, and then you're just a little uncomfortable when you, you know, when you tie into the top, yeah. so so to speak. But.